Welcome to the sixth video in our series, TJ Admissions Test Frequently Missed Questions presented by TJ Test Prep. We offer TJ Round 1 proctored exams online, and in this series, we will go over the types of problems that we have seen students miss on the exam. In this series, we hope students gain an understanding of how to approach different types of math problems seen on the TJ exam. Even if you get the problem right, watch this video as you can learn helpful problem-solving strategies that you can apply to other problems. If you want to learn more about our pra practice proctored exams or register for them, please go to tjtestprep.com. Now onto the problem. Here we are asked, what is the equation of the perpendicular bisector of a line segment connected by 1, 5, and 5, 3? Answer this question by yourself first and come back for the answer and the solution. So the answer here is y equals 2x minus 2. Let's see how we came up with this answer. In order to first solve this problem, you must know what a perpendicular bisector is. A perpendicular bisector has two traits. Its slope is the negative reciprocal of the slope between the points, and it passes through the midpoint of both the two points. Now the first step in solving this problem is finding the slope of the line connecting 1, 5, and 5, 3 which we can just use our slope formula of change in y over change of x, which gives us 3 minus 5 over 5 minus 1, which then gives us negative 1 half. Now we take the negative reciprocal of 1 half, which is then equal to 2, which is the slope of our perpendicular bisector. Now to find the midpoint of 1, 5, and 5, 3, we simply take the average values of the x and the y values. So here we get 1 plus 5 over 2 and 5 plus 3 over 2, which then gives us the point 3, 4 we now know that the perpendicular bisector passes through the point 3, 4. Now, using point slope form, we can figure out the equation for our perpendicular bisector. Plugging in the slope 2 and the point 3, 4, we are left with the equation y minus 4 equals 2 times x minus 3. That simplifies the 2x minus 6 plus 4, which then leaves us ultimately with our final equation of 2x minus 2 equals y. For more information about our TJ test prep services, including proctored TJ practice exams for round one and an SIS essay prep course for round two, visit us at tjtestprep.com. If you are interested in our services or like our videos, please contact us at prepfortj at gmail.com. We will be happy to answer any questions you have. We also have a blog series online where we write about helpful TJ admissions tips. Visit us at tjtestprep.com slash blog to read our posts. If you enjoyed our video, please like and subscribe. To keep up to date with our YouTube channel, we frequently post, so subscribe with post notifications turned on by hitting the bell icon to be notified when we upload. Thank you for watching our video.